Right then, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to The Binding of Isaac. And welcome back to me being at 100%. I'm going to explain the past couple of days to you as I play this fantastic game. I don't know why I feel like this game is more appropriate for me to sit down and speak to you about something real quick because the day I took off and then the only one video on the next day, I just, I just feel like this is a video that's appropriate, or a game rather, that's appropriate to quickly explain that one. I felt like I got a dick. I felt ill, kinda. And it wasn't so much that I felt ill to the point of not being able to do anything, it was just that little illness of, eh. It was essentially an energy and motivational sapper. It didn't do me any favours. So if I had made content on those days, it would have been terrible. And it's not to say that the stuff I make anyway isn't bad to begin with, but hey, we're not talking about that one. But yeah, I just really quickly wanted to apologize for taking that day and a half off. Sincerely, I mean, come on, you've gone to expect two videos a day from me. I, I should, I should be, I should be keeping that up for Christ's sake. So now that's out of the way, back to playing the game. Oh, Bob's brain. And we still got a bomb-related item, but on the plus side, at least it was a good one. Right? Oh my god, I need another goddamn dice. Are you serious with these rooms? With these items? I, f I found better quality gear from Ikea in the middle of a fucking all things must go sale. And there are never good things in those sales. Mother- <clears throat> Well, at least that cleared the room out for me. In terms of convenience, I'm kind of okay with that. Anything else, however, and that was a kick to the dick. Oh, I got the secret room card! Cracking! <gasps> oh, you are just being far too kind! And now I get two items for the price of one. If I was smart and placed that, I don't even need the moon card anymore. I've got three things for the price of... Okay. Magic mushroom. No, I'll, I'll try again. Magic mush... No, I'll, tr I'll, I'll try I'll try again. Fourth time's a charm? Nope. This is gonna be bad. Uh, it's not that bad, actually. Well, two out of three pills have done nothing for me. And the last one was what I thought the first one would be. Hmm. <laughs> I love it. I... I hate myself. If my luck got any worse to start this one off, I'd be convinced I was Warwick Davis playing Leprechaun. Oh good, I didn't even get a devil deal. And there's the magic mushroom that I wanted. You see, it, it all came full circle. I wanted that goddamn item. When I was in the secret room, the secret room gave me a piece of motherfucking shit held down, and now, when I've finished the floor in the room, it's... We've restored what we have lost. We'll look at it that way. And free item for me! Good lord! Please be health up. All that, that'll do. Now I don't even need the bloody other thing. Wait, I can re-roll this. I need a bloody battery! Oh, just burn in the fiery pits of hell. Did that just give me a dime for being hit? You know what, I take it back! I love you! I'm sorry for being mad at you. Okay, games being oddly charitable all of a sudden. My god, I, I look like the saddest candle ever! Please be good. Oh! <laughs> I'm just that much closer to being guppy. I now only need one more of those items, and I'm absolutely home free. And you're gonna give me some soul hearts. Or you can give me everything but. Kinda hard to complain. Ah, be an item. Well then, the odds of me making it to full guppy status have gone from 10% uh, likelihood to motherfucking hundreds. And there I thought that this run of guppy wasn't going to be oh so lucky. Consider... Never mind, we will just look at that as a free pass, right? We'll just look at that as a free pass. I mean, we got out of that room without having to do anything. Worked out for the best. That's what I'll tell myself. It's not true. Peep! Oh man, one of my most favourite motherfuckers in the whole wide world, and you are stuck between a rock and a hard place. Because <laughs> you can't hit me from there, bitch. <laughs> oh, this is hide and peep. Except there's no peeping required on my part because, um... Don't have to move. Oh, there's no way I'm taking that. Never in a million years. Here comes the pain! <laughs> have I ever mentioned how much I fucking love you, have I? I could. Oh, I can't even pick that up, so now I can't reroll it. Let's reroll this! And I regret nothing, because now I can go back in here and pick this up anyway! <laughs> You can't write this shit, man! You can't! The awkward moment where you have spectral tears with an item like a brimstone where it makes about as much difference as having a comb over with about three fucking follicles of hair being left. So now I'm the ever so lucky guppy with brimstone and God knows what else in the future. I can't wait to see what it is I end up getting by the end of this. Thank you! You actually gave me something good, dude! Are oh, you feeling kind? Oh, I don't want to leave the dice behind, though. 
Fuck it. There's no way I'm leaving by in this combo. No way in hell. It's the Catacombs 2, and I already have this item combination. And now I've got two tons of I know I could go back for the dice, but let's just be grateful for what we're given so far, shall we? Let's not be ungrateful. Let's just take what we get and smile about it. Because we have no reason to be frowning right about now. We have none. Now I have BFF. So my cube of meat has become a cube of doom of meat. Whoops, wrong button. I almost forgot how to use the OP combo. I'm almost brain dead. Wow, we have one sole survivor, and he managed to accomplish about as much as uh, a thumb war. Oh man, I just feel like I'm cheating doing this shit, I really do. I feel like I am, oh my god, and I'm even more guppy than I was to begin with. Jesus Christ. Please bear in mind that I got that from a gold chest. That was not Devil Deal related, and I still ended up getting that. You, you can't beat this! This is Guppy and Tammy's fucking Brimstone Adventures, bitch. This is fantastic. Clifford the Big Red Dog doesn't have shit on this goddamn story. <laughs> Considering the things that I just killed. With this item combination, the amount of effort that it takes, it really does feel like a hollow victory every single time I come out on top. I mean, it's just like... All I need to do is walk in a room, press L, and move a bit, and I'm fine. Greed! Oh, I'm so glad it was you, because I didn't have any money to buy anything, and now thanks to you, I do! Oh! Contract from below! Crack like a ding-dong, man! Thank you so much! I'm tempted to buy that just for the sake of it! I mean, I'm not going to, that'd be fucking stupid, but... Let it be known that I wanted to. Hey, finally! We've got some positive pit. The health down became a health up because we were in that much of a dire strait. You know, life is good, and life is fine because I've got some good times, and holy motherfucker, I just realised how much money I've got. <laughs> holy shit. That's just a little bit of a benefit, isn't it? I'm in the back of your head! It doesn't proc all the time, but... Oh, it'll do. And here we see the boss rush actually being rushed. Quicker than everything important in life when there's an episode of Game of Thrones to watch. Filing your taxes? Doesn't matter. Taking your children to school? Doesn't matter. Helping an old lady that's fallen down the stairs get up and not die right there because she can't help herself? Doesn't matter. You've just got to see how they're going to end this season. Because as the old saying goes, you know nothing, Jon Snow. I don't know what that voice is. It's supposed to be a David Annabelle impression and it just gets all weird and creepy. Holy shit, I can get flaming shots! <laughs> Goodness gracious, great beams of fire. Um... I'm OB. Oh, I can get another copy item! Oh, fuck it, I will, I don't care, I don't care if it like, doesn't really benefit me all that much, I'd much, I'd much rather be 100% guppy. All I need now is the... the collar, right? I've gone, like, the completely wrong way. Seriously, stop being mean to me. I said stop being mean to me. I literally mentioned I'm going the wrong way and ask it not to do it anymore, and then I fucking end up going the wrong way I got them again! By the way, I don't want to jinx myself, but have I even been hit so far? I get the feeling that I honestly should have bloody played as the Lost. I mean, I'm not saying if I'd played as the Lost I would have gotten the exact same thing, but my evasion look has been through the motherfucking roof. I mean, seriously. I, I think I could have actually gone somewhere with this. Blitz shot with... How would that work? Oh, I'm infinitely disappointed. I was hoping it'd like hit him and then branch off in two different directions. Why couldn't you have done that for me? Bloody hell. If it weren't for the fact I had an insta-kill, that would have been a hell of a room. <laughs> Just when you think you've peaked at your level of OP-ness, you... <laughs> <laughs> Didn't quite realise what I was saying. <laughs> level of O... Penis. PENIS! For fuck's sake, the fact that I... <laughs> I'm not sure what I hate more, the fact that I said that without realising, or the fact that I did not think to say that by myself. Oh, as I was saying, just when you think the level of OP that you are, not saying it again, just when you think that that's peaked, it, it just keeps going. It just keeps going. It's ridiculous, dude. I didn't get hit in the cathedral and the chest. Suck my fucking knob. Suck it. Suck it until your mouth dry and then it is. I win. My win. You remember that moment when I said, you know, I don't think I've been hit. I was right! Holy shit, I think I just got one of the, well, potentially, hardest achievements in the game. You know, the lost ones don't count. They're obviously the hardest. But if we're talking non-character specific, I think that's probably the hardest one. Especially when you consider the fact that it does count when you get hit with the shield. It does count that, I think. Because I've had it before, I've lost no health, but never got it. Life is great and life is fine, because I completed the game and actually got an achievement for it. That's rare. There are so few left to unlock, that's a fucking joy. I didn't get it for the last two floors. 
Suck my dick. So on that note, ladies and gentlemen, I think I'll be ending the episode. If you enjoyed this and do indeed want to see more of it, then please do like the video to let me know so that you can broadcast that information to me, and I can react accordingly by making more of it. And seeing as my content has gone to a close, I wholeheartedly recommend that you check out any of the featured content right here and now. Well, featured content creators, but you know what I mean. And more specifically, I'm going to have to recommend to you Chadronic today. Well, not today, because there are two videos and I do panic pick one person every time, but you know what I mean. There's a lot of self-correcting going on here. His content is utterly fucking marvellous, and every single video he puts out makes me laugh. I mean, it's, it's such a joy. He isn't a frequent content creator, such as Tomato or I, says the guy who took a day off for fucking out of nowhere, sorry about that again. So each and every single one of his videos is infinitely more special than it would be with Tomato or I. I've said that twice now and it sounds weird, I don't think I can English. So yeah, for the love of all things holy, go and check Chatronic out, his content is just brilliant start to finish in my opinion, he deserves infinitely more recognition. And one final thing, I hope they request you follow me on Twitch, Twitter, and my channel, because there's something on all those for all of you. But to decide, I'd like to think that you do want to see more of this, and if you do, like the video to let me know, and then I shall make more of it. And assuming that you do, then considering the fact that I did not get hit in, in, in those last two floors at all, then I guess my first statement about Dear Old Guppy was wrong, as I was the luckiest motherfucking guppy alive! <laughs> it's not a joke! I didn't end that on a joke! I just wanted to win that on a note where it's like, holy shit, I couldn't have been about- I couldn't have been more wrong about what I was saying about what I was gonna do. I can't fucking believe that I did as well as I did. It's actually, I'd say it's skill, but it's not. It's like, oh, you did real well dodging all that damage, but no damage was being dealt when you were killing them before they even had a chance to fucking blink. Never mind trying and kill you. Ah, uh, I- I did something good, mommy. Feel proud of me. Uh, what the fuck is my life? It's pretty fun.